guys, it's Cordella here. I just wanted to say hey. Um, I'm actually on the road to Atlanta. I meet Dr. Ghost Nine tomorrow, so I'm so um, excited to meet him and grateful and nervous and curious to see how this is going to pan out. So I just want to thank you guys for following and for all your encouraging words and comments. See you guys soon. Welcome back. That is Quindala, who was in our studio two weeks ago. She is the young woman who survived cancer at the age of 14, only to lose her teeth and suffer damage to her jaw because of the treatments. A team of highly qualified dentists in Atlanta saw her story and offered to help her for free. Well, now Quindala is in their care. I am a social media influencer but I'm not 100% honest with my followers. Name of prayer, man. When we first met Quindella, the radiation treatment that cured her cancer at age 14 was taking a heavy toll. The side effects from the radiation, it deteriorated my saliva gland. She'd endured more than 100 mouth infections. Dentist after dentist had told her there was little they could do. Quindella tried to adapt working out of the public eye in a call center using stick-on teeth she'd found online. But time was running out. I've thought about, um, you know, trying to pull out my own teeth, but, you know, this isn't healthy. When Quindella came to Chasing the Cure, the outpouring of support was overwhelming from fellow cancer survivors. Okay, I will do whatever I can to help you. Other social media influencers. You are so incredibly brave and this extraordinary offer from one of Atlanta's top restorative dentistry practices. We look forward to, to helping you regain that smile and regain the function as well and the quality of life. And what's more, it's all going to be free. Wow. wow. I'm going to let you catch your breath. Wow. Last week at the offices of Goldstein, Garber and Salama in Atlanta, Quindella found what she's been dreaming of. A team of specialists was determined to take on this challenge. So nice to finally meet it's you. It's so nice to get you here. I feel like I need a hug. I'll give you one. <laughs> Thank you. It's going to be a very nice day. Uh, we've got a lot of things planned for you. We've got a whole team in there. Oh, we have a team for you. CAT scan and oral exam revealed the extent of the damage. Number one, decayed. Yes, complete decay, non-restorable. The radiation damaged the blood supply to her jaw leaving it fragile, limiting their options. So this is actually her open vertical. Right now, what we're dealing with is the complications to radiation. And for that reason, we are not able to do any surgical procedures. We cannot place implants. We cannot do any corrective jaw surgery. So what? Or extraction. Or extractions. We have to understand that it's a medical problem that limits us what we're doing now. And in the future, we hope that medical advancements will allow us to maybe extract teeth, do implants, and whatever we need to do for her. But certainly this is a, uh, the most conservative thing that we're doing, and it's trying to contain the infection that she has. So what we're gonna do is try to see what we can save of the tooth structure that's still available in her mouth. Dr. Tadros is working on that as we speak. All right, so we have the scan of the lower here. Dr. Goldstein's team agreed on a path forward that includes hyperbaric oxygen therapy to strengthen her jaw, followed by a series of surgeries to remove infected teeth and restore her oral health. The goal is to build a healthy tooth structure that can support a durable upper and lower denture. But before she left, a surprise. Custom built temporary dentures. Open a little bit more, perfect. All right, are you ready to see it? Let's do it. Let's take this off. Oh, wow. This is amazing. You love it? I'll... <laughs> You're very well. Thank you, everybody. This is... It looks so... Looks so real. Woohoo! I see it all. <laughs> And there to greet her as she begins her journey forward, her father, Steve. It's wonderful. <laughs> I'm just so happy and grateful and like to everybody here. I, I just thank you because 
It's been a long time, and... I'm grateful. Thank you.